Hey, Good Fox here. Today we're going to talk about the dynamic players in Mutt 17 and how you can get them for your squad in Mutt 16. So let's talk about with this bundle right off the top. It contains two rookie premier collectibles, six gold or better players, and four other non-player items. The, I'll link the blog that EA did on this in the description for the dynamic ratings, but we're going to go through that now. I'll try to make it uh, easier to understand, although it's kind of straightforward as it is. Uh, I'll, I'll show you what I believe it to be. So we go into these bundles. Uh, this 10, you know, 10 rookie premier packs plus a bundle top that contains one NFL draft elite player. Great. I think the draft elite players will probably be hard to get because they require two in each of the sets. And this is the interesting one. Six rookie premier packs plus a bundle top that contains four random gold draft players needed in the rookie premier sets. So four random draft gold players. Keep that in mind. Those are the NFL draft players from earlier this year when we got those packs when the draft came out. So let's go to the sets here and take a look at these uh, draft and rookie sets so let's go down right now and this could change jared goff uh this set requires 15 jared goff rookie premier collectibles eight jared goff nfl draft gold collectibles and any two elite draft players complete this set to earn 97 overall goff in 16 and a special dynamic edition goff in 17 so that's how you do it you got to complete these sets to get the dynamic edition and a dynamic edition means from the blog Basically, they'll come out with their same stat, their base stats that they'll have. This Wentz and Golf will probably be silvers, if not low golds at best. I, I think, actually, we, we have confirmation they're silvers. Uh, and then if they do well, they're going to go up in overall. If they do worse, they'll go down. Dynamically rated week to week after each NFL game. So if you guys don't think these guys are going to start or play much next year, which it might be tough for Wentz especially, um, I would say maybe not invest in them in this year but you could try it and roll the dice but um you know it's, it's funny look at look at the number of items needed for Wentz here 17 15 plus 8 plus 2 is not 17 15 plus 2 is 17 if my math hold correctly math holds correctly but i've been known to screw that up in the past uh so those eight carson Wentz nfl draft gold players as of this moment today not to be there not not there in that set which is good because those gold players are going for a mint and they aren't even in the set yet. Like, let's go take a look at Wentz on the auction house just to see how much he is. We'll take a look at Wentz and Goff, see how much those gold players are. Because those have been just been sitting in people's binders, probably added to sets. They were going for like, what, a thousand or two thousand? Maybe a little bit more than that, just a little bit. So, as you can see, I did some research, I already put it in. I don't even see it. Goff is 36. Yeah, 36k for one. So, and that's not even in the set yet. Lacan, yeah, Treadwell's 890k. If those things were in the set, they'd be four times that price. People that I think are speculating, maybe not four times. Maybe they will stay at that price. Because people are expecting EA to fix this set. And I would expect EA to put out some sort of bundle. Because I don't know why they wouldn't. Now that these things are in the new sets with the all with the rookie pack. So, draft sleeper sets right now. Let's not go to there. Let's go to the back to the sets is what I meant to go to. Draft sleeper sets right now are going to be you know basically dead. Because of these new requirements for the elite players. So, this elite draft sleeper set. Like, you know, Antonio Brown's not in Madden 17 or 16 basically. That 99 overall. I don't think we can expect them, but I will expect a, a promo to come out in a little bit. Or sorry, packs. Let's see this elite, any elite player. I'm not going to click on it because all I have is the draft Von Miller, which is like a 800k player. Um, so yeah, I would say if we can run through this, the best dynamic rookies to get. Elliot, depending on the outcome of his charges that I just saw today. Henry might be a solid pick there. Um, Coleman, I wide receivers don't do amazing. In the rookie years, you know, with the exception of like Odell Beckham and other generational freaks, um, Treadwell, you know, I, I I would like to say some of these are gonna be, but last year there were only four rookie Pro Bowlers. Um, so out of these, I mean, there's what 20 sets here. I mean, how many of these 20 do you think will make it the Pro Bowl? Two or three? Because you never know, guys come out of anywhere. Oh, sorry, first round Pro Bowlers. Ronnie Staley, 96 overall. Tunzel's 96. Buckner, I, I don't know. Do you think a 3-4 left? I'm going to make the Pro Bowl in his rookie year. Bosa's, I guess, good shot as anybody at it. I mean, who of these do you think has the best? 
Jalen Ramsey, probably? I would say Jalen Ramsey might be the smartest decision to do, but I I would think his his collectibles be going for a lot right now. So let's take a look at it. You know, 20,000, we could say 25 probably. The price is probably going to go up times 15. Ooh, wow, 300 if they're going for 20. That's 300K if they're going for 20K, which, I mean, not terrible. And then uh, two elite draft players. Those might be tough to get. Let's go look at how much Elite Draft is. But yeah, so Dynamic Players at Madden 17. Um, are you guys excited for that? Did I explain it well enough? Basically, ratings going up and down how they play each week. Not much more. Uh, Mutt Guru did say on Twitter that these are the only cards. These rookies will be the only dynamically rated players in 17. So let's, let's get into opening packs as a, in, in a second after I take a look at the Elite Players that I wanted to go to for the NFL Draft. How much these things are going for. Hundred and ten. So these has another couple. Two hundred K on top of your Ooh, wow. They're being bought quickly too. So yeah, I can see the price of this thing going up because people, you know, as Man 16's dying down, they're really looking to invest in 17. And outside of MHC there isn't really much else to invest in besides for these sets. Alright, so let's open some packs. I kinda want pro packs. I've always had better luck with pro packs, and I know a lot of people have. Oh, I also got my Mutt rewards today. Um so let's take Let's see if we can pull anything hot here. Jalen Ram, nice. I was just talking about Ramsey there. Maybe I should make it. Maybe that is fate. Now, if these things are pulled that frequently out of pro packs, maybe their price won't be that high. Like that's one pro pack. We'll go to the Mutt Rewards quickly. And I already made what 25k. Let's rip it. Let's rip it. What do we got? How many goals in this bad boy? What rewards are people? Oh, Lee! Nice! I'm getting some good elites there. Could use some draft goals, would be amazing here. Draft goals or draft elites. I don't know if you can even pull them out of these packs. Wow! Okay, well, these. Uh, maybe you're guaranteed to premiere. But that is. That's a lot of coins you're getting out of these packs, these Mutt Rewards. If you guys don't know how to sign up for Mutt Rewards, uh, just Google Mutt Rewards and you can look at the bottom of the page. And we'll show you how to sign up for them. I would say it's been worth it. You know, especially because I pull a ton of packs. If you guys pull a ton of packs, definitely get my rewards. Alright. So the players aren't great, but, you know, these two collectibles are. Maybe look to w watch those collectibles rise in a couple days. Or they, they might hold steady. I just say, the only reason I'd say rise is because people got all their mutt rewards. Um, so they have those uh, four guaranteed to them. All right, let's giddy up. I'd admit, yeah. If I didn't see actually if they were guaranteed or not. All right, nothing great in that pack. Let's keep going. Let's keep chasing that dragon. Although it's it's Friday, so it's not a great day to. Oops. Yeah, let's do it here. Not a great day to pull with Ultimate Legends coming out tomorrow. I really hope they are going to bring out more Ultimate Legends. We haven't seen if that's confirmed that they're bringing out more tomorrow. All right, Jordan Reed, no collectibles. We're on the hunt for collectibles. How many times have you heard somebody excited about that? You know, a lot of people complain about EA making collectibles so instrumental in their game because players are, you know, just, it's more exciting to pull a player. Wow, I did get a gold. They're in packs. They're in packs. How much does this Lynch go for? I gotta check that out. I wonder if they gave him boosted odds. That would only make sense if they gave him boosted odds. You know, now, do you think I should sell this now? Or wait till they get included in sets in like a patch? Or do you think people have speculated in the market? 15k only? Wait, is Lynch one of the people you can put together? I would assume so, right? Everybody loves quarterbacks. Let me take a look at the set. Because if, if he's not in the set, then there's no point in having him. I should have looked through all of them first. What the hell just happened? They just took him down on me. They just took him down on me. EA. EA, EA, EA. You sick bastards. 
I don't know how to respond to that. I had fun. No, I'm not having fun. There's no sets here. Took them down because of your... You know, I, I, they've, they screwed up the last few promos. They've had errors in them. Made a lot of people some money. And then I got a little bit late to make some money off of this one. But it's okay. It's okay. We'll end it here. As we watch the transition from sets up to no sets. A historic day for man. Well, one man. And by historic, I mean absolutely normal. That's it. Thanks for watching. Call to action. I'll see you tomorrow.